Welcome back to Seven Days to Die, and here I am on my rooftop base. This is, isn't a base I've shown you before. Um, I was basically doing my Dead is Dead series and running another game, which I was just playing for my own benefit. And enjoyment, I might add. And um, I was out pounding boulders, trying to get lots of iron and one of the usual things kind of happened. Uh, the next boulder I smacked turned out to be a bear and it killed me and ruined that game. It's ridiculous. I, I was just in the desert, pounding rocks, turned around, pounded a rock, and it moved and killed me. And here we are on a 28-day horde and I'm on top of a working stiff. Horde is being very quiet. I have been pounding rocks for days. Ah, oh, here they come. Um, and as you can see, I surrounded this place with steel. Oh, dogs too. Let's draw them around here onto these spikes. Let the spikes do the most of the work. So, the last, as I say, two or three days I've been working on uh, getting these iron bars out here. So the first view I saw came from over there. What are you doing over here already though? That's the question. Yeah, so... Bears. They're vicious. They're mean. They're tougher than you. Let's get some XP. I was going to just let the... Hang on. I just heard cops. That's disconcerting. Where are you, copper? He's out there in the dark. Oh, I missed him. I got him that time. He's going to blow up, though, isn't he? Whatever I do. Doesn't sound healthy, whatever he's doing. I am not going to be able to put enough arrows into him to stop him doing that. He's probably knocked a hole in the wall now. It's not too much of an objection because I'm not actually based down uh, downstairs. But you know, I think that's the first copper I've seen on a horde night. Hey, did I earn some XP then? Fantastic. The first three, um, I think this is the, th no, th I think this is the second horde night I've done here. Last time I just had wooden frames going around the roof. And obviously by spending a few days pounding on boulders, whoa, I was able to improve the situation slightly and get some iron bars. Which that copper, he would have just blown away the wooden frames, but he's done some damage here, let's see. It doesn't look like it's repairable with a hammer anyway. Come on, I want to hit somebody. Is that a... Oh, it's a spider down there. Whoa, see how high that dog is climbing on the other bodies. Good grief. He's almost up to the bars. He must have been on the head of someone who was standing on the back of somebody else. God, he's right up here again. How do these... These mounting dogs or something? Got climbing claws built in? Is it worth trying to hit him in the head, seeing as he's got a helmet? I don't know. Go away, spiders. Oh man, he's coming up. Do they but hit the things above them? I wonder about that. When they come up the wall and under your bars, do they do any damage to the bars? I don't know.
Ah, oh, come on, I need to kill this one to get some XP. I think that was a hit. And a kill, I think. Yep, that was a kill. So I've got one kill. I've got Spinny McSpinnison over here. It's amazing, hitting boulders. Um, you can see I've got up to nearly 300 on my tool smithing. And I've got steel tools. And it's just amazing how quickly you can get through those boulders, even with uh, lower quality steel weapons, uh, tools even. Moving too quickly, these guys. Can't get them in the head. I think that was a miss. That was a hit. crawling over bodies now. Yeah, they're still coming from that way, so if I move down the side, I should draw them along on over these spikes. Oh, mind you, these spikes are covered in bodies now. Which means they're not getting hurt when they're crawling over them bodies. Another footballer! the third one I've seen. So three footballers and a copper. Oh man, I just can't hit them from here. And they're right under you. It's just it's really hard to get a, get an angle on them. Whoa, did I get a headshot? Stop your crawling, you crawler. Oh well, I got a hit in. Yay, I think I got another kill. Oh, now we've got a miner. We're getting all the higher level ones now, because I've not died on this playthrough. So I generally play dead, he's dead. So if I'm on day 28, you can pretty much guarantee that I haven't died up to that point. Okay, I think... I'm collecting quite enough loot here now, so let's get some bodies on top of these spikes. Oh, he felt that. He felt the shot in the bottom. Has he dug a hole there? Looks like he has. Oh, I've got myself another hit there. And another. Oh, I thought he was down for the count. He was just faking it. Die! Oh man, there's another minor one coming. At least we're down to midnight now. We're nearly through this nightmare. Spend the whole week just getting ready to deal with this, you know. Oh, good shot. Good shooting, Tex. Even if I do say so myself. Okay, we got nobody around here, so let's let's see if they'll come running around the corner and die on the spikes over here. The more I can spread their bodies out, the more loot I'll get. I recently got the sniper rifle schematic, uh, but I literally, I just got back to base before the horde, so I haven't had a chance to put that rifle together. I've got about 50 pistols in my weapons box, but again, I haven't found the pistol book yet. Which is odd, because that's usually one of the first things I find. And here I am, the early hours of day 29. No, not a, pi not a pistol book. I got the mini bike, which I've gone up to, you know, day 70 and not found the, the mini bike. Yeah, here they come. They're coming around here. What's he doing? He's running on my spikes. That's just rude. Didn't your zombie mother teach you any zombie etiquette? Dogs. Do you know I haven't seen dogs? Do they still do a dog day? So day 28, it would have been day 26, I think, would have been dog day. But I didn't see any dogs. Oh, look at that, he's trying to knock out my spike. He's got himself trapped. So he's not getting damage off the point of those spikes, he's maybe just being hit in the side with it. I haven't got a hope in hell of hitting his head there either. Look at that, another dog. Is that dog attacking that spike? 
nut job. Come on, come and get your medicine in sort of arrow format medicine. Yes! Oh, I'm getting some kills here. Archery's gone up. Oh man, they're trickling in now. Where are you going, pal? Oh, did your little legs fall off? Poor little zombie. Yeah, have an arrow. May might make you feel better. Come on, I need to get some more kills here. Ooh. Yes, just like that. Oh, this guy's head might be doable. Did I get him? I did. Okay, I think this is uh, turning out to be quite a good horde night. I haven't been swamped. Nobody's got up here yet, fortunately. And they're just trickling it. What's with them dogs? Is that one alive? Are they, oh, they're down the bottom of my ladder. I thought I'd lost a steel spike then for a minute. Oh man, loot. Loot's explodinating. Look at those dogs, they don't know when to stop moving, do they? Is that it? Have I defeated the majority of the horde? See, I'm inclined to go take a peek. Actually, that would be very silly, thinking about it. If there is one spider out there, he will demolish me. Because I'm just not that good. Certainly not good enough, I don't think. Take that, Mr. Zombie Man. And they're not stopped coming, they're still out there. Wow, this guy... Yep, yeah, and there's proof of the pudding. New guy walks in. Yes, got him. I thought he stopped then. That was pretty weird. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get on them spikes and die, man. Yes. That's another body for looting. Well, I need these guys now. Just come in here and drop a pistol book. That's all I really want at the moment. I've got enough pistols where I could combine them on my workbench to make a 600. Yes, I think I've just got another one. I can hear somebody running. What the hell? That? Oh, he was on the ladder! come up the ladder. So he must have been standing on a on that dog. He was standing on that dog and that let him get up the ladder. <coughs> can I turn the dog into a gore block? Well, I can make it disappear. That's almost as good. See, they're coming from this way. I've got more spikes around the other end of this old working stiff building. I don't really want to uh, go around there because that is not going to help. Hey, stop hitting my spikes. Um, they'll probably just try and come through the building or something. Which would be bad. Oh, hole in one. Hey, dog. Die. I saw Joel's video for the upcoming Alpha 16 and they got wolves now, I don't know if they're going to replace these zombie dogs with wolves or better still add them in as well I think that is going to be awesome the dog looked like it was moving and turning properly as well which is a huge difference to these crazy spazzed out things these dogs just spin on the spot for hours at a time and they get caught up on rocks or trees and basically just become useless at that point. You can just literally dodge around a couple of items and then you can get away from them. 
which I mean, it's good from a survivor point of view. It's not good from a sort of realism and uh, enjoyment point of view, you know, from the scenario you're playing through. You want it to be realistic. You don't want to have them obviously bad AI problems. You know, you want to have zombies that move like zombies. You want to have dogs that move like dogs. See, this guy's legs haven't gone out because he's standing on all that loot and demolishing it. So let's move over here and get him... Yeah, that's it. Let's get him over here and breaking down his legs on some other spikes instead of breaking out loot. One of these has no doubt got that wonderful pistol but that I so desperately want. Come on, die, guys. Boy, am I glad I made as many uh, arrows as I did. This is a 600 bow as well, and I'm now getting some uh, serious wear and tear on it. Another one coming round the corner. No, he's trying to knock out the corner blocks. What is this? Is this a crawler? Yeah. Another crawler attacking spikes. That's no way to behave. I mean, it's just zombie rude. Whoa, I'm getting some serious lag now. What's that all about? 3.40 in the morning, lots of lag. Is there too many bodies down here? Is that what it is? Or is there a new wave just appeared? Okay, I'm going to move away from here where there's lots of bodies. I didn't want to come up this other end, but it might reduce the lag. Because that lag can be pretty lethal. What is that sort of groany noise? What type of zombie is that? You can see around this end. Oh, they're coming in from over here now. Interesting. Hey, stop bouncing. I'm trying to kill you. Hey, look at that, four o'clock. No more zombies. That's how you deal with a horde night, even when it's a bit laggy. <laughs> just walking near the edge when it's laggy like this is scary. Whoa. There's another cop. That was that noise I was hearing. I didn't know what that noise was. I guess I do now. Was it just that cop causing the lag? The lag seems to have disappeared. Oh my giddy aunt. I think that's it now. Oh no, there's still someone out here. Where are you? I've got to finish you off and then it's going to be the grand looting of old looting town where are you zombie i heard you are you crawling somewhere i'm glad they didn't come from this way because i've only got a few steel spikes and one row of iron around here the other end is where i did most of the work i got the iron bars i got the steel spikes but here Whoa. I nearly went down there, even though I knew that was there. That copper seemed to be the cause of my lag issues. I'm not getting a sound now. Okay, what have I got on me? Okay, rather than jump down there and risk getting uh, pummeled, let's take a little look in my box of joy. And I think somewhere I've got concrete blocks. 
there they are. So let's put them down here and let's go downstairs for a little look-see. Oh, I should have closed that because I suspect I'm going to have some damage down here on the outside walls. And again... So on day one I came in here and I filled in all the doorways with wood and then as the zombies have been bashing the wood out I've been replacing it with concrete. Oh look, we've got some damage here. But not a lot. And this is the corner where I was standing up above here most of the night. Look at that next to nothing. A little bit here, a little bit there. Nothing significant. Cool. Oh, that's not bad. And you see the floor's all wood in here. I've been putting down, um, bit by bit, I've been putting wooden plates down because um, a few nights ago I had some zombies actually spawn inside. So I'm hoping it's true, the rumours I've heard, that zombies do not spawn on player placed blocks, which if true means these plates will stop zombies uh, spawning in that part. But uh, this, I must have missed some. How can I have got away with so little damage? Are those steel spikes good enough that it stops the zombies having time to pound on the walls? Wow! If that's true, that is impressive. Yeah, I need to keep this closed. I've been getting very slack with that. Okay, let's just see. I put two grand, two thousands of iron from a day of pounding boulders in here. Because I was running out. Yep, there's the steel I was after. Excellent. Let's head over here and get that on the workbench. Because I need a new pickaxe, because the one I'm carrying is almost at half durance now. Is that a word? Durance? I think I just made that up. Okay. Let's commensurate with the de-zombification. And those are real words, definitely. Okay, maybe they're not real words. Hmm. Am I going to get a lot of empty zombies around here? 100% empty so far. Well, oh, that's more like it. A little arrowhead now and then. God, blimey. A lot of empty ones. Oh, I'm seeing a lot of damage on these spikes, actually. So the steel took some damage during that. Do they lose their loot when they break down to this level? No. This is going to take me hours. Checking each of these. Looking for that missing pistol book. Yeah, I'm just getting a load of junk here. Okay, a lot of clothing that I don't really care about. And <laughs> Sham. Unlike Skippy's game, Sham doesn't do you any good on this game. Next to no damage. It's amazing. Absolutely amazing. Okay, folks, we'll leave the video there because I'm going to just spend the next real world hour probably going through all the bodies scattered around here. And then I'm going to have to get a lot of steel to repair these. They have done a cracking job though because I've had next to no damage to my walls. And it's got to be down to these killing them. These spikes doing a lot of damage. Okay, folks, see you next time. Bye.